Let's graph the linear equation 3x plus y equals 2. And we're going to use slope-intercept form to do that. So what we need to do is rearrange this equation so it's in slope-intercept form here. It means we need to get y all by itself. Let's subtract 3x from both sides. So that gives us, but let's move the 2 to the end and the 3 up front. In that way, we have slope-intercept form. We have our x here, negative 3 is our slope, and we have our y-intercept as 2. So y-intercept, that's 2. That's where we cross the y-axis right here at 2. So that's where our line will cross the y-axis. Then the slope, let's call that negative 3 over 1, because then we can say rise over run. It's still just negative 3x, which is divided by 1, but we have our slope here now, negative 3 over 1. So we go to our y-intercept. We're going to rise negative 3. If it was just 3, we'd go up 1, 2, 3. But it's negative 3, so the rise actually goes down 1, 2, 3. And then we run 1 to the right. Let's do another point here. We go down 1, 2, 3, 1 to the right. You can see we have a line here. Let's put a line through that. And we'll put arrows to show that this goes to infinity. And that's the graph for 3x plus y equals Two. You could also use a table of values to figure this out, and you get the same graph. So our slope is negative 3, or negative 3 over 1. Y-intercept is 2. It's Dr. B. Thanks for watching.